Hey everybody, in this video I'm going to show you what comes inside the New York Mets Sports Crate, which is a subscription box service uh, that Lisa and the kids got for me for my birthday. This one came in May, it's the first box, I'm a little late getting it uh, unboxed, but I'm liking the subscription so far, it's a great gift, I think. I think subscription boxes are a great idea if you're looking for a gift, and if you have a sports fan in your house, especially baseball, um, this is a great gift. They don't have every team, but they do have some teams. You have to go to sportscrate.com to check out what teams they have. And this comes once a month. The price on it, I believe, is $40 a box if you do it individually. A season pass uh, for baseball is $180. There's a 10% discount on that because there's five boxes. And there's six months in the season sports crate. So I don't know. Maybe you can get next year, start in April. So we open up the box and we can see it's full of goodies and there's even a little pamphlet that you can pull out and you can, a, this is my first one, so there's a little welcome uh, certificate saying, you know, welcome to, this is your very first one, I hope you enjoy it kind of thing. And then there's this, you know, looks like a little ticket and you open this up and it explains everything that's inside and there's a theme and this box has a theme called bringing the heat. And so you see like, you know, there's a lot of uh, pitching. Uh, oriented stuff so we can uh, take a closer look but this will explain everything that's in we're going to get a figure there's going to be a, um, a game in this one there's a shirt there is a baseball card a pin and down here it's also you get a, a, a one month subscription to MLB TV um, if that's your thing I tried it once but because I don't know if they changed it but I tried MLB TV once but um Unless you travel outside your team's market, um, I wasn't able to actually watch the games on the internet. They were uh, they were blacked out. So maybe they changed that. And the other thing it mentions is uh, with a subscription or any with any loot crate, um, you get a golden ticket opportunity. Possibly there's a chance that there's going to be a golden ticket inside, kind of like you know Willy Wonka thing, where you get a once in a lifetime experience, like throwing out a first pitch, or meeting players, or doing something um, that you wouldn't ordinarily get to do which would be awesome, but I don't think I'll ever get it. But it does mention that season subscribers have double the chance to win a golden ticket. So there's always hope, you know? So uh, that's what we can look forward to in this. So let's check out the first item, which I have here, which is a, it's, uh, which is a shirt. It's a baseball shirt, a three quarter sleeve shirt with the New York Mets logo on it. And it's pretty cool. It's a nice uh, light tech material, which I'm really into these days. Um, especially during the summer and during the baseball season when it gets hot, especially, you know. Um, but it'd be great. I mean, I could see myself wearing this to a game or just wearing it around. And uh, when they do the subscription box and you sign up and you get it for yourself, or you get it for someone else, they'll ask you what your size is. So um, you can put in your size so you get the, the right size for that. So this is pretty cool. I'll probably wear it for the next unboxing video that I do for the second box. So that's my, uh, my, my new... New York Mets shirt. So I'll put that there. <coughs> Excuse me. So next thing we have in here is a cooler. I don't think that was on the box. Maybe it was. Did they mention that? No, this was not mentioned in my little uh, little guide. So this is a little just uh, foldable, collapsible, like you call it, uh, insulated soft side cooler. So it says uh, sports grade. It doesn't say Mets on it. So. That's all right, but it, it's great to have one of these for taking a lunch to work or uh, in the car for a, a road trip or going somewhere and just having snacks or taking to a picnic or something. It's great, always great to have something like this. So it's pretty cool. It would've been nice if it had the Mets logo on it to go with the theme, but I guess, uh, you know, it's a gift. So I still appreciate it. And I'll probably, you know, get some use out of it somewhere down the line. So that's pretty cool. It could probably fit like a, maybe fit a couple sandwiches, a can of soda. You could probably fit if you just put some beverages in there. You probably get a six pack in there. I think you could probably squeeze that in there without adding any ice packs. So it's pretty cool. Uh, next up, we have our action figure. Um, it's a collectible figure from Ballers, which I'd never heard of before. This, um, it's, you know, got the MLB logo on it. So can't keep up. When I was a kid, I used to collect all these kinds of things that I could tell you all the companies that made them, but now it's all different. So this is Noah Syndergaard, um, whose shirt I happen to be wearing today. You can't see the back, but I have the same number 34. And um, it says on here that it's got like 21 different like, points that you could, um, where it bends and you could pose it. 
So here is, you know, checking it out. Yeah, and it does, like, you can, like, not only does it fold at the elbow, which most would normally do, and rotate at the shoulder, but it also can bend at the wrist, and that glove can go in, and the ball can go in, and you can, and then I guess you could do the same thing. Yeah, it swivels here, like mid-thigh, it kind of swivels, and the knee bends, and then you can also twist the feet. So yeah, it's got some extra places where it can bend. It can bend in the mid torso and turn at the waist and the head. Okay, it manipulates and you've got a mound, a pitching mound with little uh, points where the feet can like, you know, attach to. And this way you can pose them in different poses on the mound and display them. And I'll have to figure out what pose and uh, what area of my house I'm gonna put him up. So that's pretty cool. Um, especially since a uh, big fan of Thor right now so put that right there uh, next up is our pin we have a uh, pin just going with the theme bringing the heat it's got the Mets logo on it it's got a baseball flames you know you know so it really captures that theme that they were going for for bringing the heat so that's kind of cool and then the last item in here is um, which doesn't look like it fits the theme until you think about it a little bit it's a Travis Darno cornhole tabletop cornhole game so this would, you know, I guess it fits a the theme because you would then be Noah Syndergaard or another pitcher throwing, you know, fastballs at Travis and trying to get, the, you know, get it in his catcher's mitt to score points. Um, if you don't know what cornhole is, um, it's usually we see it out here at like wineries or um, farms. You know, it's like a, it's it's usually a lot larger. This is the tabletop version. So you got these, you know, bean bags and you toss them from a distance, like maybe 20, 30 feet. And try to get it to go in the hole and it's kind of like horseshoes you get points if you get it in the hole some more points um like probably like three points two points for like being on the board or maybe leaning in the hole if you don't get it on the board or in the hole you get zero so and we'll take this out and we'll see that it uh has a little fold out stand to stand it up on the table and then you would stand it like this and then uh if you, if you were playing with me i would give you these bean bags and maybe I should open it up and take a look at the bean bag and see what those are like. But they look like they look like little baseballs. They're square. It'd be better if they were round. If they were round, it'd be that much more cooler. But you know, and you would just throw that in and see if you can get it in the hole. So, so that's what it is. But you know, I think I think the kids and I would get you know uh, get a kick out of playing with this at some point. So. So that is everything that came in a subscription box. Like I said, uh, sportscrate.com. They did not um, give this to us. This is not uh, sponsored at all. This is um, just something my wife thought that I would like. And her and the kids uh, got together and got it for my birthday. And I really uh, am enjoying it so far. I got another box that came um, for last month that I still have to open and go through. I'll do a video for that one. Probably you know, wear some of the gear uh, that I got and have that on display when I do that. So... Uh, come back if you want to see that one. Check out sportscrate.com if you want to check out what they have and maybe thinking about getting a gift for somebody uh, that's a sports fan in your life. So thank you for watching. If you like what we're doing, hit subscribe. Um, comment below, ask questions or anything that you have about the items in there or about um, anything you want to ask about. You know, I'll keep an eye on the comments and I'll get back to you when I see your comment or question. And uh, also, if you are into toys, uh, just keep in mind that we're going to be having some toy unboxings that we're starting to do. We recently uh, got contacted by some toy companies and they sent us a box of goodies um, to take a look at for the 2017 holiday season. So we're going to take a look at what they sent us and see uh, what's up with that. So you might want to stay tuned for that if you're into toys. Okay, so until next time. All right, uh, we're bringing the heat with Sports Crate.